Hey everyone, today I wanted to talk to you about a really, really simple, easy way, 15 minutes a day, that you can use to improve your GCSE grades by one whole grade. And this isn't just in science, this is across the board. So every single GCSE grade up by one grade. And that is reading. Now I know some of you are going to switch straight off when, I, when you hear me say that. But it is really, really important that you can read well when you go into your GCSE exams. All I'm asking for is 15 minutes a day. Just pick a book. It doesn't have to be a book. It can be a comic. Um, it can be a website or a blog that you like. Just 15 minutes a day of reading. Um, this is important because GCSE questions are getting long. They're getting really, really long and wordy. And if you're not used to sitting down and reading for a long period of time, I have students that look at that question and don't even bother to read it. Just turn straight over. So what I want to do is to get you used to reading, get you enjoying reading. So I've decided to start a little book club. And the book that we're going to start with is uh, Looking for Alaska by John Green. John Green wrote um, The Fortnite Our Stars and Paper Towns, which has just come out as fantastic movies. You should definitely go and see those if you haven't. Um, and I thought this would be a really, really nice book for us to start our little book club with. So hopefully um, you guys will join me. Um, it'll be really, really great to know. So pop it down in the comments below if you're planning on um, joining us. And then in about a month's time, I'll post a little video review. Um, and then I'll put some questions and we can have a nice little discussion. We can have a discussion over on Facebook as well. So I'm going to like I said on Facebook so that um, you can be part of our little book club over there. Yeah, I've never run a book club before. So if you guys have got any ideas, I'd really, really appreciate you sharing them. So I'm really looking forward to reading this. Um, I hope that you will look forward to reading it with me.